Hi, I'm Tyler Jubenville. A Christian food fanatic who's eaten at almost every major Christian event. We know, you're late for Bible study. And now I'm on a journey to pick out an America's easiest to access fellowship times. Oh hey Tyler, have a seat. I was just showing everyone pictures of Lake Louise Camp that takes place July 2011, the 10th through the 16th, 2011. And also, Big Kids Camp which takes place this and every Memorial Day weekend at Crystal Springs. It's an adult camp for people who are out of high school. And take on church's legendary food challenges. I'm not a competitive eater. Well, I hope you're not a competitive eater because we are five people and we have only food for four people. Just a regular Christian with a serious appetite. This is my ultimate hunger quest. This isn't funny anymore. You're scaring Grace. Make it stop. We just need to enable him, and that's the quickest way to get this whole thing over with. This is Christian, man versus food. One of the recent additions to Lake Louise is they hired a new chef, and she used to be like a fancy chef. They got everything is awesome from breakfast to dessert. What? You boys talking about dessert? You know what? You want to see a great dessert? You take these Nutri-Grain bars, you stick knives in them, and you know, I hear they call these Nutri-Grain bars on knives. Where I come from, they call it the Tyler Jubenville. What if I miss my mom? After a few days at camp, you're not even going to want to talk to your parents again. But, but what if I really want to write? I mean, you'll still have a chance to write or talk to them if you really want to. Oh, that makes me feel much better. What's happening when I have fear? What? Uh, what happens if I'm afraid? Camp isn't a place to be afraid of. Camp is a place to grow closer to God and closer to each other with your camp community. Grace, can you not text while we're trying to do a shot, please? Please? Thank you. Hey, Nick. What's the food like in Germany? Do you really want to know this? Yeah, I want to know. Well, it's kind of like a lot of meat. You know what I hear? In Germany, they call it the Tyler Jubenville. But I'm concerned about the cost of Christian camps. Well, cost is a concern. The best place to turn to is your local church. A lot of times they provide scholarships for campers. And then also a good idea would just be to message the camp deans. The financial part of it should not keep a single person from going to camp. All right, so you got your marinara and your chicken alfredo. You put that together, and they call that the marifredo. Or as I hear, the marifredo calls it the Tyler Jubenville. Tyler, what are you doing? I'm doing the ultimate food challenge right now. You see, you take the marifredo, you take this marinara sauce, and you put your grain on a knife, and you take it, and you just mix it in there. You Tyler Jubenville it. Now I bet you're all wondering if Tyler Jubenville can do this. They don't call me Tyler Jubenville for nothing. Can he do it? I can do this so fast, you wouldn't even believe it. I need to hear it from you guys. Tyler, Tyler, are you ready? Tyler, Tyler. Are you ready? Put hair in your food. In German, come on, Tyler. 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 Come on. All right, here I go. Ah, yeah. I've done it. I've done it. Yes. Yes. I'm the top Iron Chef nightmare. Well, now that's over. As I was saying, we have a couple of Christian camps available to us this summer for the older versions of yourselves. There's Big Kids Camp which takes place this and every Memorial Day weekend at Crystal Springs. If you'd like more information on Big Kids Camp, you can go to bigkidscamp.com. Then also, if you're still in high school, there's Lake Louise. And a good place to find information about that is lakelouisecommunity.org. Or you can check in at your local church for more information. And if you can't make the time for camp this year, there's also other camps available. And there's also plenty of volunteer opportunities. And donations are always accepted for sponsoring youth to go to camp. So I guess that's my whole camp talk. Sorry about the whole... Food thing. Christian camping? Where I come from, they call that the Tyler Jubenville. What if I don't have time this summer for camp? Well, camp's still a few months away, so you should have plenty of time to plan ahead and get your obligations squared away. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>